Hey guys, I'm Dom Ultra, and welcome back to another Worth It video. This is a series where I buy bundles in the Dying Light 2 store, try them out, test them, see if they're worth buying at all so that you don't have to. Now today we have a very unique kind of bundle. It's the Brudja bundle. I don't know if I said that right. But what's so unique about this is the Knuckle Duster's weapon, since not many bundles have this. Now to start off properly, this bundle will cost you 500 Dying Light 2 points. And it will give you an outfit, a knuckle duster's weapon, along with its blueprint obviously, a charm, and a paraglider. Now starting off with the outfit itself, as some of you might know if you've watched my previous videos, I love outfits that like kind of fit into the zombie apocalypse theme. And when you look at this, I'm sure many of you could agree that this could fit into a zombie apocalypse theme. Like This is something you could see someone wearing in a zombie apocalypse. So overall, I'd give this outfit a 8.5 out of 10. I mean, outfits don't really matter unless you're doing like photo mode stuff or just trying to show off to your friends since you can't really see this in third person. Now up next is the paraglider. Now I actually quite like this paraglider. It's got a lot of details. It's very like, like you can tell some effort went into this paraglider, like just the art and whatnot. It's nothing too simple and nothing too crazy. You know, it's something to actually admire. Now up next we have the Anarchy Grasp, which is the Knuckle Duster weapon. Now you can see on screen what the starting damage is and what it will cost you to fully upgrade it. In my opinion, uh, this is kind of a weapon that you get to enjoy. Like this isn't really something to grind for or to, you know, do a speed run. This is just more of a fun weapon to use and that's about it. There's no mod slots, which I think is the most important thing for a weapon if you want it to be effective. Now, of course, it doesn't mean that's completely bland. There's a bleeding effect, which could be useful. But other than that, this is just for, you know, fun. That's about it. Now, lastly is the Brudja Charm. Now, if you were paying attention to the video that was played, I attached it. And all this really does is increase the damage, but only if you have very low health. So, I mean, it says the amount of health you've lost relative to that. But in all honesty, I think it's best just to use the grenade charm that does 4% more damage. Now, not to say that this is useless, but, you know, if you have a different charm, I would use that instead of this. So, to conclude this video, I'd say this bundle is worth it if you're trying to have some fun. But if you're trying to get an edge on the game and, you know, get a head start, I would not recommend this bundle. It is fun, though. So yeah, that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you find yourself coming back, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.